the stillage is first rotted to a large rotary dryer. This process cuts the water content to approximately 10%. Back at the distillation column, evaporated ethanol moves through two additional distillation columns to complete the distillation process. The process of creating fuel-grade ethanol is nearly complete. When it exits the third distillation column, the ethanol is 190 proof, or 95% ethanol and 5% water. To bring this up to 100% ethanol, a vapor phase molecular sieve or mold sieve removes the remaining water. The final step is called denaturing. In this phase, petroleum-based fuel is added to the pure ethanol to a content of 2 to 5 percent. This renders the liquid undrinkable and outside the regulations that control other distilled products such as whiskey or gin. From on-site storage tanks, trucks and rail cars are filled with ethanol and dispatched to gasoline distribution terminals.